What is good with y'all? It's your boy, Curdy Buff, and I am back with another big body banger, man. And in today's video, I'm about to just be showing y'all how to use auto-tune. Before we get into this video, make sure y'all like, subscribe, and comment, man. You already know the vibes. And stay tuned for more big body bangers, man. You already know we on the road to 12K. We really going up with this, so I'm gonna keep, keep this going, man. If y'all wanna see a part two, or you know, see more videos like this, just uh, comment some ideas down below, and I'm gonna check them out, man. But without further ado, let's get into this video. All right, y'all. So now that we in the uh, now that we in the track, this is just the um, behind the scenes to my song I just released. It's called SRT. It's, it's only on YouTube right now. Uh, I'm gonna let y'all get a little listen to it, and then I'm gonna just show y'all, you know, how I got down and you know how I used my auto tune. And, and how I got my auto tune to just sound crispy. I'm hearing what you're saying, babe. You the one that made me feel this way. And I've been going through this pain. I'm just hoping for them better days. Uh, uh. Now, that, as y'all can hear, man, it's sounding smooth, it's sounding crispy, high quality. And little do y'all know, I recorded that just off my phone. No high quality studio equipment, literally the iPhone. Um, but uh, y'all know what I mean, bro. I, I literally recorded it straight off the iPhone. No, I literally just use headphones. But we about to get into these presets, man. So let's check it out. Now, I, I got the graphic EQ on. We got the EQ3, you feel me? Pause the video if you need to. We got the, another graphic EQ to you just, you know, make my... Um, Give, give my vocals sound a little more sharper now um we got the studio reverb got the fbk compressor man we got the noise gate and i did not i do not use dual octave that's just for the deep voice effect but um usually what i do is i, I use the graphic eq i put on the graphic eq first do my eq3 throw my graphic eq back on and then the rest is just history you know but um now we about to look into my auto tune and as y'all can see, it's a 90%. You never want to have your auto tune on 100% unless it works. But like nine times out of 10, man, don't put it on the max. Put it almost to the max if you want to like a, a heavy auto tune on your voice. Yeah, man. And then the rest, you just got to just hit them high vocals. As y'all can see in the waves, you got to, you know, get loud. You got to, um, what I use is a monitor. I turn the monitor on and I listen to myself. I play around with little melodies just to see how to uh just to see how I sound, man. Yeah, don't don't worry about the key. I'm pretty sure Band Lab automatically sets the key as soon as you put the beat on, man. But yeah, bro, auto tune is really easy to use. You just gotta, you know, throw a dope preset on there, you know, turn it up to like 80, 90, and you good, man. But hey, I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this video and uh, gain some value from it, man. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, and comment. We on the road to 100K. Well, I ain't even gonna say 100K yet. We definitely on the road to 100K, but we got, we got to get to 20K first, man. On the road to 20K. But uh, yeah, I'm done talking your heads off, man. I'm gonna catch y'all on the next one. Curdy Bo in this thing. Curdy Bo out, man. Peace.